Hey YouTube, today we're going on another trail. We're just airing down and we're going to go with my friend Steve and his Cherokee and his other friend in the Wrangler. So stick around, hope you like it. Just a back story on my friend Steve. He's a great friend of mine that will take his shirt off his back to help anyone out. In this particular instance, he pulled me out of this pit that I got stuck in. So thanks, Steve. We first go to a place called the Valley of the Names. And the first time I heard about this, I had no idea what to expect. However, as you can see, the name speaks for itself. After exploring the Valley of the Names, the journey takes us north to the Picacho Circle Loop. Death, won't you roll me right over to shore? Tell me about the ones that were here before. Skeleton hands. Every man passes, but few understand. The good and the faint, good for nothing at all. Cause death takes a swing, and the good enough fall. At least that's the sense that I get from the Safe from the weapons we use. And oh my God, we were wrong, we were wrong all along. Been sailing round this lake of fire, where good boys go to die. Along the way, Steve had a few minor issues with his suspension, so we stopped to make a few adjustments. If it comes out, then it's fit for desire. 
Toyota. It's like a Jeep, but it actually works. I spotted a tarantula along the way. The spider is so big that I could see it while I was driving. Hardly spoke folks around him, didn't have too much to say. No one there to ask his business, no one there to make a slip. The stranger there among them had a big iron on his hip. A big iron on his hip. It was early in the morning. He came riding from the south side, slowly looking all around. Big iron on his hip. Big iron on his hip. In this town, and live an outlaw by the name of Texas Red. Many men that tried to take him and left many men were dead. We finally arrived at the Colorado River at the Picacho State Park Recreation Area. I have to admit that the trip around the Picacho Circle took longer than anticipated. More than 19 more. Now the strangers started talking, made it plain, folks around. Was an Arizona Ranger, wouldn't be too long in town. He came here to take an outlaw back to life or maybe dead. And he said it didn't matter, he was after Texas Red. After Texas Red. Wasn't long before the story was relayed to Texas Red. But the outlaw didn't worry, men that tried before were dead. Gotta tighten the suspension up. Man, that is a savage tool. Real man's wrench. Tightening up the suspension. been a good day, Steve. Thanks for watching. Be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. This is Mark, and you're watching Wayfaring Overlander. And as always, take care and tread lightly. And feel free to hit me up on Instagram at Wayfaring underscore Overlander.